Very good evening, viewers. I begin on a regretful note. I regretfully inform you today of a plot to plunge India into political chaos in the ultimate act of treachery, so to speak, two individuals have been trying to eliminate our Prime Minister, Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Times Now has access details of a chart sheet filed by the Surat anti-terror squad that reveals that two radical Islamist terrorists came very close to executing a plot to assassinate India's Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Here are the hard facts. Up front, as always, Gujarat ATS files chilling chart sheet. This chart sheet details and exposes a terror plot. Investigators intercept social media messages that have been transmitted and found on the equipment, telephonic devices and, and other instrumentalities that have been recovered from these two individuals. The suspects plan to procure weapons and when they were doing so, they were tracked, apprehended and subsequently after pen drives from them were recovered, this plot came to the forefront. Now the two Islamist radicals who conspired to assassinate Prime Minister Narendra Modi are Ubaid Mirza. He's a practicing lawyer, resided in Surat, part of the social media group Ansar ul Tahweed. There's another conspirator, Kasim Stimbarwala. He is a hospital lab technician, resided in Surat and wished to join a radical group in Jamaica. Now, a chilling, chilling and damning confession has been extracted. The messages that confirm the plot. The medium used was a social media app, the group's name Ansal ul Tahweed. The center was Ubaid Mirza. This happened on September 10, 2016 at 11.24 p.m. And what was the content? The content was, if a pistol is to be bought, I will try to find a contact with him. Again, medium social media app, group name Ansar ul Tahweed, sender Kasim Stimbalwala. September 10th, this message was sent 2016 at 11.28 p.m. The content of this message is very, 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 very alarming. And let me quote directly. Ya, yeah, says this individual to the other suspect. Let's take Modi out with a sniper rifle. This is the conversation. This is the conversation that transpired. It's very serious, very diabolical. It's all now mentioned in a chart sheet which has been filed in a court. There is enough, according to our sources in the ATS, enough information, enough proof to prosecute these two individuals. The group name Ansar ul Tahweed, which is really a extraction of a very diabolical terror organization that is banned in India. And that, and that terror organization is called the Indian Mujahideen. Viewers might recall that the Indian Mujahideen was active in the late 2000s when it carried out several terror attacks across the length and breadth of India, posting some very threatening messages promising to break up our nation. Now, the questions that arise are obviously serious, but before I get to them, I want to go across to Nikunj Garg, our internal security editor, who knows a little bit more about this diabolical attempt and plot to kill the Prime Minister. What can you tell us, Nikunj? 
Well, Rahul, uh, in terms of the incriminating evidence, there is a 164 CRPC statement which is clearly recorded in front of the magistrate. These, these, these individuals were the member of the same messaging group, same messaging group, that social media app from which these messages have been recovered, who have now, some of them have now turned police approvers and they have volunteered to rec uh, record a statement in front of a magistrate, understanding the full gravity as cautioned by the duty magistrate who recorded that statement. The fact of the matter is also this, Rahul, that in Ansarul Tawheed is a splinter group, as you said, of the remnant elements of the Indian Mujahideen and Indian Mujahideen in the past has displayed an ability which probably no other terror group which consisted of primarily Indian youth, primarily Indian Muslim youths has displayed and that ability is to strike across the country even in cities like Jaipur which have never seen any kind of terror strike before Indian Mujahideen struck that city and uh, a, an uncanny ability of using technology to the best of their advantage befooling uh, best of the investigators and best of investigating agencies in this country like we have seen uh, the use of open Wi-Fi is by Manzoor Az uh, Azgar Peerboy in case of Mumbai terror strikes when Indian Mujahideen struck that city. So clearly that group has the determination, that group has the technological wherewithal. In the past it also had the kind of uh, necessary muscle to carry out those terror strikes and this Ansarul Tawhid becomes a little more dangerous because these boys have exposed some of them these boys have moved from Pakistan to Afghanistan where they have been exposed to some of the most deadly terror organizations and that the sniper rifle Rahul that they are talking is very interesting because sniper rifle is something that you will only find in our immediate neighborhood in places like Afghanistan it's not a weapon weapon very easily available inside India or even uh, just outside India so very clearly they have the wherewithal they have worked out their uh, plans and uh, two of them actually wanted to escape to make good their plan and th that's when the in, uh, ATS of Gujarat which has done some exemplary anti-terror work and I must here also inform our viewers that it was on the initial tip off for the complete bust of Indian Mujahideen actually came from Gujarat ATS it was only on the tip off and some telephone numbers recovered by the Gujarat ATS that the Central Intelligence Bureau started working on it but and Indian Mujahideen was finally exposed and before that that Batla House encounter took place so clearly it's a diabolical group with the necessary wherewithal to convert its thought into an actionable plan well stay on with me because obviously the question that needs to arise and will arise and needs to be asked rather and this question is a one that the opposition must ponder has the time come now for the opposition to end its demonization of Prime Minister Modi with its hateful rhetoric. Here are some instances in the past when Netas resorted to hateful statements against Prime Minister Modi, which create a sense of alienation, disenfranchisement amongst a section of our population, or at least have the potential to arouse such feelings. Listen to some of these sound bites. They were made in the heat and dust of political campaigning, as well as, of course, by individuals who thought that by portraying our Prime Minister in a particular light, they could actually gain politically. The damage will not be, will not be restricted to a political party. It will be restricted it will in fact spread across the nation in an eventuality such as this. So politicians, watch out. There are serious implications to the irresponsible statements you make. Let's first play out these statements. I'll jog your memories, viewers. Think about this. <laughs> गुजरात की सरकार चलाने वाले झूठे बेईमानी डर और मौत के सौदागर हैं वो गुजरात समझ रहा चार परसेंट मुसलमान है गुजरात में यहाँ बयालीस परसेंट मुसलमान है यहाँ गुजरात में छोटी काट देंगे छोटी छोटी मौत का सौदागर वी विल कट हिम टू पीसेस सम वेरी रिस्पांसिबल स्टेटमेंट्स मेड बाय द ऑपोजिशन they continue, they continue in different contexts, even now. We have heard Khun Ki Kheti. We have heard several other references 
odious references to the Prime Minister, subtle dog whistle politics to evoke a certain sentiment amongst a certain section of our polity. And in the wake of the assassination plot against the Prime Minister, should the deliberate demonization of the Prime Minister in political discourse stop immediately? That's the fundamental question. And I'm opening this out. Dr. Sudhanshu Trivedi, national spokesperson of the BJP with us. Rakesh Sinha, RSS ideologue. Dr. John Dial, an activist. Majid Haidari also joins us, senior journalist. Sabah Nakvi, senior journalist. Ilya Sharafuddin, Islamic scholar. I want to begin with you first, Sabah Nakvi. There is no doubt. There is no doubt that we have had some irresponsible hate mongering that is predicated on, I would not use this word if I didn't think it needed to be applied, but seditious in the context of the Prime Minister's personage. And it was used to arouse a certain so... hate amongst a certain section of our society. Should this end now? Should this stop? So Rahul, okay, so Ra Rahul, first of all, a country which has lost two prime ministers must take any threat. I'm talking about Indira Gandhi and Rajiv Gandhi. Two former prime ministers have been assassinated in India. So any such story that your correspondent has got should be announced to the nation by the government of India with all the evidence that there is indeed such a plot to kill the current Prime Minister. I mean, we have lost two Prime Ministers. One no, at why the hand of Punjab it? militants, the other at the hand of the LET. We it's all mentioned know in that. a chart no. sheet. So let me finish. The conversation saying, has been cited. I hope this will be an announcement. No, you, you, you can have a chart sheet. Sabha, there can Sabha, be a hundred. I want to question. see this, this story in a way where no, an uh, agency the says is there the is a threat answer. to the Indian Prime Minister. I want to see that. No, I, I'm no, giving you a fair answer. answer. Then the about answer. the demonization, the you are suggesting that no, it is, is sedition. It is sedition no, to criticize the Prime Minister. Not criticize. No, you don't demonize. tell me what the answer is, Mr. Sinha. Demonize, demonize. You allow me Using to words then like you can say. Sodadar. I'm saying. No, no, that's not criticism. No, no, Motka Sodadar is not criticism. Boti, Boti, Karte, Prime Minister, both of Sonia Gandhi. No, it's not. No, no, please, please, please. Please. Listen. That what is if Boti there Boti is a Boti section of Prime society Rahul, which feels Rahul, Rahul, alienated no, from the Prime Rahul. Minister of what India? What is Boti Boti Karting? The Gujarat riots. Sabha Nakvi, no, no, please. Sabha Nakvi, please. As far as minorities go. When someone Sabha, stands up and says, I'm Prime Minister ko Boti Boti Kartunga, that is not criticism, ma'am. Let the agencies tell me. Is that criticism? I want the agency. There must be a national announcement of this threat to the Prime Minister with the agencies giving us. It you don't trust very, very the ATS? You don't trust 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 we that's how we know the matter ministers. is now in public record. No, you can go to the I'm court, saying. seek this document. You will be given access to it. So I hope we will have a very, very serious thing. You can't every now and then have a chart sheet saying there were these guys were plotting to assassinate the prime minister. Then 13 years later they get off because there is no evidence, no, which is what I, we have had I, in this I, country. I, I have to take. And I will not no, be I have to take a little bit of offense. Of this is exactly the same you know? sort of logic that was proffered. In the Ishra Jahan case, uh, I just want to open this out. Let's let's get the other side. Yes. Fair enough. You stated your case. <laughs> You're saying that we don't want a situation yeah. where no ownership is taken by the executive of these claims, and we have a situation that ten years down the line, these individuals are then released because there was no evidence to substantiate the claim. Ma'am, a chart sheet suggests that there is evidence yeah, exactly. prima facie yeah. to carry out a trial because there must be some evidence but setting that aside you didn't answer my question yes, i'm absolutely. talking about the irresponsible vilification not criticism vilification 
of the Prime Minister's personage think, with uh, the aim I of alienating a particular think, section of society to ensure that that section of society Rahul, 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 has a deep-rooted psychosis ne, Rahul, sabha, against the Prime Minister. Let, sa, let, let the RSS answer is that is not because of Rahul, what the politicians do. Mr. That Sina, is because of the history of the Rahul, Gujarat Rahul, 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 That you know, is because of the BJP Rahul, and RSS. Rahul, you look at Rahul, the mission statements of the RSS. It is yeah. all targeted at Muslims. Rakesh so Sinha wants to come in. Sawa, Sawa, Sawa Nakvi, don't make an ideological issue. There is no space Sawa for Nakvi, Muslims this in is, the BJP is, or the RSS. This is, this is, I'm sorry, you can't. Uh, you, uh, Sawa, Nak, Sawa Nakvi, this is not the answer. This is not the debate. The debate is that, you know, since 2011, this is the sixth Please attempt of the life the of the Prime answer, Minister. Sir, this is the sixth attempt. You when have Times no answer, now is revealing something, which is based on ATS Charsi. You are, you are, you are Mr. Shahabuddin, one minute. You are questioning the integrity. I'll give you your opportunity. Don't interfere media. right now. You are questioning the integrity of the media. Okay, I'm reducing his volume. You know, Laskare Taiwa, in Patna rally in 2013, and Telangana police has killed five person in, in, in 2016, five suspected who were planning to kill Prime Minister. In 2013, in October Patna rally, there was a categorical plan exactly. by Indian Mujahideen so we must have to create an announcement. an anarchy and kill the Prime we Minister. Must all be in 2011, Laskar Taiwa, two, two, two were arrested who were connected to Laskar Taiwa. And this time, when there is a political discourse, you know the conspiracy and political discourse. And what has happened to those cases? Side. I want to know. When Sonia what Gandhi is the said evidence? Mokta Sodagar, you can make any I'm, before the Patna uh, was also Sawa, before Sawa, the Bihar can, election. Patna was also patience. before the Bihar can election. Have a patience. When you are provoking I'm, the entire yeah, Muslim on. community, that they look, you know, have you heard the word? There is an ideology I'm not talking about which, this. which wants to which wants to kill you, I which wants to create extinct to the Muslim community. Very then urgent. you are trying Any to create a provocation. You are inviting the, 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 the nation. The nation should be no told. Why do you carry on talking about Muslims, Mr. Sena? Calm down. Calm down. You have beaten Muslims. Calm down. Calm Wait, down. I'm Don't be so agitated. I am talking Muslims about the covering just, somewhere. Mohammed, Jaise Muhammad. I am talking about the ISIS. I am talking. I am talking about the Indian Mujahideen. Why are you relating to religion? You yourself say that terrorism has no religion. I am talking about you these terrorists. Muslim, Muslim, who Muslim. Who so maybe? You carry but they belong Muslim, to Muslim, Muslim, Muslim. Muslim. They belong to Indian Mujahideen. Yeah. They belong to Jaise Muhammad. They belong Mr. to Sina, ISIS. Calm down. These are the four agencies who yoga. are targeting the Prime Minister. I can tell you, but at I the same time, yoga, right, so Sonia I Gandhi tell you, to left liberals. Calm down. They are giving message to these calm agencies. Calm down. That, you know, there is a Prime Minister yeah, but the people who is who a killer died, of 2,000 people. Prime Minister have been assassinated in this the country. Guardian. The I'm Guardian making a point here. From London. We must right take it very seriously, sir. No, let very me come in. Very seriously. Let me come very in here. Seriously, we let have lost two prime ministers. I'm asking we a very specific question of Sabah Nakvi. Sabah Nakvi, very, 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 very specific question. Okay, yeah. Dr. Sina, one minute. Let me come in here. I'm asking you a very specific question, Sabah Nakvi. I didn't ask you about whether the Prime Minister should make an announcement, whether the government and the Home Minister should come out and make an announcement about the existence of a plot to kill the Prime Minister. I'm only asking you, have words like Motka Sodagar only fanned hate toward the Prime Minister in a certain section of society? It's a simple question. Okay, why so let me answer without the others the jumping in. There is the a Lord? history to why there is... I don't think it's hate. I think it's more apprehension. It's apprehension. more apprehension. The whole... If I think the Prime Minister, if he was to reach out, reach out, he is the Prime Minister of all Indians. I think I would request the BJP and the RSS to encourage a Ma reach are out you, to Muslim communities. Are you creating a rationale? They managed to rule. They are you creating a rationale? I don't know about the RSS. I'm For the assassination of the Prime Minister, RSS. what is going on in this country in the name of politics? But the, they need to reach out. Ma'am, why are you providing radical RSS Islamist hate group a Hamlis. rationale or a defense? Minorities uh, give them tickets. Speak to How them. does that matter? You know, every time I answer, Rakesh Sina jumps in. No, Rakesh Sina, one second, I please. This is let her respond. A political I'm going party to have to lower is there for representation, right? Please, Rakesh Sina. I would request the Bharatiya Janata Party to start. Uttar Pradesh has 20% Muslims. They did not find one candidate. 800 worthy. tickets have been given request in West Bengal. To actually embrace Muslims. 800 Muslims tickets are, have been given in West Bengal please. to Muslims. Let me finish. By the BJP. You can't make this about representation, ma'am. 
Are we trying to there rationalize no and chance. give terrorists now a no reason? Of them winning. Are we trying to defend them? Where has terrorists got into this, Rahul? What Are do you, you think? Saying, first, you say they're demonizing Muslims. I'm saying Muslims want to be embraced by the Prime Minister of India. So he they doesn't. He's there. not they shunning want them. To be part of the political process. Let the BJP Rahul, reach out to them. Seconds. One minute. One minute. I want Let to bring in Dr. Sudhanshu Trivedi. One minute. BJP national spokesperson, Dr. Yeah. Trivedi. I asked a simple question. Have words like Moth Ka Sodagar only fanned hate towards the Prime Minister in a certain section of society and should this be ended, this demonization of the Prime Minister? Do you hold it responsible today? I think the demonization I want, of Muslims should also be I ended, would reply no? this and want to reply on also what Sabha has said. If there is a threat perception, all persons who are having high level of security are having threat perception. But it's not always the government agencies announce it. I give an example. SPG cover is only for Prime Minister, a special protection group. But Sonia Gandhi ji, Rahul Gandhi ji are having this cover despite they never became Prime Minister. And even Priyanka Gandhi is having despite the fact that she was not a member of parliament. It means they are having threat. Per threat. There must be certain uh, threat perception. It doesn't mean that government agencies should come out openly and say this 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 was the reason that's why we are doing this surely now coming threat, to prime minister modi surely i would like to say plot there were the threat perceptions to several prime ministers in the past she, but Singh to hold a prime minister conference. narendra modi ji is the only leader in the entire indian history who has been targeted by one of the worst possible adjectives and one of the most hatred words in the entire post indian independence but by the same lobby prior to advent of uh, modi ji in indian politics in 1993 blast of mumbai you remember 12th march 1993 for which the daud ibrahim is still wanted these type of people have said this was a reaction to babri masjid if at all your logic was correct then what was the reason of London, Madrid, Brisbane, Brussels blast? That's why I am saying somehow or the other you are trying to cover up. When Modi ji is targeted, why were those type of leaders who has gone to the extent of writing to US Congress that Modi ji should so, not be given visa because he is a killer or so, 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 uh, despite the fact Sidanshu, that Modi ji never applied for you visa. Are, uh, Sidanshu, this was the please, height. I appeal this to the height of hatred. I appeal to you. When a leader says that Modi ji ki boti boti ka dunga. And the very next the day Rahul Gandhi goes for his campaigning. He was a Samajwadi party candidate. And not only that, then he comes to Congress party, became vice president of Uttar Pradesh. I am appeal to you. Congress. And share the details. No, man. Man. that's all very no, well. Really well. We have shared the details. Please give ATS, my details to the television channel. No, no, please. Man, ATS, ATS has come out and filed a charge sheet containing the details. Let, let me, me, let me the once again acquaint you with the facts. You don't Rahul need any Mayak government Mayak to come out and tell you. The ATS is doing its job. It is submitted the details. I want to say. I find it strange. One minute. There are certain leaders who who has by mistake or by design have fallen into the trap of violence. We never said that Ra Rajiv Gandhi ji ki policy was wrong, Tamil itne mar gaya, is liye hona sahi tha. Despite the fact Mulayam Singh Yadav has openly said that I could do more than this, that I had to kill 16 Hindu. Despite we never said that Mulayam Singh ko ye kar dena chahiye, Mulayam Singh ko mar dena chahiye, aisa nahi karna. That's why I am saying, but Modi ji ke liye sab kuch kaha gaya. That's why there is a technical aspect, there is a political aspect. And I want my answer on political aspect. That this type of hate bothering should be stopped. No, no, one second. Which is why Rahul and Priyanka have SPG cover. No, one second. I'm sorry, you must acknowledge that Indira Gandhi was assassinated. I never heard, no, no, I never heard anyone. But no, please. Don't try to brush away. Please, please, please. No, please. This is very irresponsible. Which is why Rahul and Priyanka get SPG cover. Can I come in here, please? Give me 30 seconds. It's a sensitive issue. Yeah. I'll, I'll just brief our viewers so I would on take what the anything. ATS... Ma'am, please. I would want every detail. I would take such a... Thing I am giving you the details. Me. I've got and the chart sheet. I'm reading out of the chart sheet. To tell me Can you give me 30 seconds, ask. please? Yeah. What Can you give me details for which Gandhi family should get SPG covered? Because it remains up to the security and intelligence agencies. Yeah. That's true. No one asks for those details. No one says, why is it that they're getting SPG cover? But when it comes to the Prime Minister of India and the fact that there's an assassination plot, people want the Prime Minister himself to stand at Red Fort and give an announcement. 
instead of condemning out of hand a terror plot no, I want out of suggesting minister. that yes I perhaps the, the prime minister, minister is a victim of irresponsible rhetoric directed detail. against him to create a divide in our society and alienate him from a section of society he is asked now to come out and give a certificate that he is under attack ridiculous I mean, I find this a bit ridiculous, but nonetheless, he's so let powerful. Me, he doesn't need to be alienated. He can reach out. What do you think? He saying, is reaching Rahul? out. He's so powerful. He, he doesn't reaches need to out. Be alienated from anyone. He meets. He, he meets out. people from the. He was the, once not allowed into the. He meets US people and from the Muslim he community. Out. He hugs all the. He goes to. He, him no, go he he let sends chadars. No, he sends chadars to places of worship. He visits masjids. He does as much as Rahul Gandhi is doing. To, to embrace himself so a ticket, and, and ticket ingratiate himself with the Hindus. Uh. Representation policies and to stop the tickets hate have been given. of the Kader. Tickets have been given in West Bengal required. to Muslim Rahul. candidates. The of the Muslim community have you seen? Rahul. Rahul. The Muslim community have you seen? Is is okay, one minute. Of, I want to bring in Nikunja. Nikunja just explain to me. I, I don't understand. What does the chart sheet say? The chart sheet says that on September 10, 2016, 11, 24 p.m., Mirza had messaged. Pilot by you are trying to endorse the rhetoric against the Prime Minister, which, which is a necessarily against, against uh, encouraging the terrorist. You I am only asking a simple question to and I am not getting a direct and, and answer. Rhetoric. By the the Sinan Ji, I want to open this debate out. Who are calling I want to open this debate Sinan. out. You, you, I want no, to bring in others. John Dayal. Dr. John Dayal joins the panel also in this debate. I understand anything that I say. No, please. Let's not get sidetracked. The questions are extreme. They are directed, they are pointed tonight. I want to bring you in, Dr. John Dayal. Has the opposition, through its irresponsible rhetoric, only given a line of defense for terrorists to rationalize their actions today? Should words like Motka Sodagar which many people say only fanned hatred against the Prime Minister, alienated a particular community in a certain section of society, should they not have been used? Let me put it this way. I am as shocked as you are. Mr. Modi, I don't like him very much. I don't like his politics. But he's the Prime Minister of India. As a Prime Minister, he faces threats properly, I'm sure. If, if the charge sheet is filed, there must be a reason. If the it threats are born out yeah. of irresponsible but, 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 rhetoric no, no. that make him no, no. The a hate figure amongst a certain section of Indian society, is that rhetoric responsible? Should those words have been issued, sir? Simple question, Dr. John Dayal. Mr. Don't spin me around tonight. Mr. Modi as Prime Minister Should the words faces that Prime Minister threats. Modi is a Motka Sodagar that we should cut him up, boti boti, should they have been used? Simple. Should the opposition today stop the vilification? Stop this because the consequences are dangerous, sir. Your debate takes place even as the campaign ends in Karnataka and the elections. I am not linking them up. The campaign... Oh, so are you the, suggesting I, I, that I, I, we've broken I'm, this news to influence, generate sympathy for the Prime Minister? How callous! Dr. I John Dayal, where have you left your the sense Prime Ministers of, of India perspective? Face and that is why they are given SPG protection and I'm sure oh, the so ATS that's okay. has taken so let's, you action. Know, no, no, one second. So, so, the threat, so, so the threat arising out of irresponsible hate mongering against the Prime Minister, that doesn't matter. Let that the continue. Prime the threats will come. He will be a target, but there's the SPG no, no, there no. and he should be protected. Should we not be asking the other question? As much No, no, should we not be asking the other question? No, sir, the, BJP, chicken neck. the BJP Ridiculous, leaders sir. make threats, open threats against everybody else. Name Does me one threat uh, against Rahul Gandhi that has been made by a BJP leader, Sonia Gandhi. Name me one. They have... No, no, name me one. Calling them foreigners in India. Is foreigners in India? Is that a threat? No, that is actually. No, no, that's no, no, please, please, please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sir. I want to get the BJP in on this. Let me get the BJP in. Can you equate calling. How can he condemn Sonia Gandhi? Can you equate calling somebody an outsider? Siddha Ramaya, Siddha Ramaya calls the Prime Minister an outsider in Bengal, in Bengaluru, and in Karnataka. Nobody. No, that is not that is not irresponsible. Opposition. No, is but that not irresponsible? Listen to me. 
Yogi Adityanath has called. Has called for violence. Mr. Bhish, repeatedly. What is the India? message? No, no, come on. Don't Nobody trivialize this. Called. This is Nobody a very serious called. issue. Name I'm asking person. you a question. You name one person. Have words like Motka Sodagar only fanned the hate towards the Prime Minister in a certain section of society? Yes, no. Dr. John Dial, answer me. Mr. Modi. Yes, no. If yes, no. If yes, no. This yes, no. Yes, no. Answer me, sir. Yes, no. If there is no have words like Moth ka Sodagar only fanned hate towards the Prime Minister in a certain section of society. Answer me the question. Could. Yes, no. I don't know. You don't Could. know. Could. You don't know. I don't Could. know. Could. No. You don't know. No. Mr. Answer Modi me the question, sir, threads. unambiguously. Mr. Modi have words like many people, Moth not only ka from Sodagar section. only fanned hate towards the Prime Minister the in a Prime certain Minister section of society. of India faces threats from many sections oh, of society I see. because of actions he right. takes as the Prime Minister Oh, because of, of action he takes. The, so you are rationalizing a terror threat against the Prime Minister uh, of this country? Two sir, people have been killed sir, in the sir, past. Mrs. Sir, Gandhi was killed. Sir, was Mrs. sir Gandhi not killed? please maintain a certain sense of balance. Even now. No, 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 no. Are you rationalizing you this? Link. Are you rationalizing a terror threat by suggesting because basis. the Prime Minister makes a statement here or there? Despite he deserves to be assassinated, taken down, using sniper rifles. I'm asking you this question, sir, today. And in in all honesty, in which do you really believe this? Has the do you really charge? believe this? Has the atheist charge? Sir, do you, do you really believe this? Has you answer me my question. Charge? You are creating a rationale for terrorists to explain so their me. death threats. Charge me. I'm not has asking you. I'm not. I'm asking you the question. Has the atheist charge with Sonia Gandhi with criminal conspiracy? No. So she's free to call people Motka Sodagar and hatred logic. against them. God, but by this God. logic, she's let Kashmiri me get the BJP. Or the, or the let me get the BJP. Kashmiri Pandits or Kashmiri Hindus should have license to attack any Kashmiri leader. Hmm? What does this yeah. mean? Okay. I, didn't I want no, to go across the Nikunj. So Kashmiri Hindus are not going to be able to Let's get the facts from Nikunjkar. There are people Bulaan who are not believing the facts we believe on this show. No. We believe Saman the facts. says, we don't believe let the government come out and make a we statement. The government has made its position clear in a court of law. It. Now, Why it doesn't have to go it? to every citizen and tell them that the Prime Minister is facing the a plot against his life. No, one minute, one minute, one minute, one minute, sir. One minute, one minute, one minute, one minute, please. I'm only quoting documents. I want to go across to Nikunj. Nikunj, what are the facts? Illuminate some of our panelists here. Well, Rahul, I, I, I'm sure Sabha knows that a charge sheet is a public document. She can access that document uh, as much as any citizen of India or as we have access. A charge sheet is not a secret or a hidden document. But I'm also sure at the same point of time that sensitive trials of this nature in the past in most countries have actually been held in camera. This is certainly at this stage not an in-camera trial. This is an open public trial. So the facts are you know in front of everybody to see. A magistrate has recorded recorded a 164 CRPC statement of so one of the this, initial collaborators new, in that, so uh, in that particular group who has now turned who has now turned site and also allow me to finish allow me to finish about, about, allow, allow me to finish the f uh, no, it's, it's a fresh case it's just about it end of, towards the end of 2017 and beginning of 2018 no one second Sabha Nakwi these individuals were arrested in September in September and let's be very clear about the facts. Hmm? They were arrested by the Gujarat ATS on October 25th. Yes, 20 I just want the facts. Ma'am, I'm giving okay. you the facts if you allow me. October 25th, 2017. So we are talking about about six months ago. Investigations have been carried out on these two individuals. One of them was about to flee the but country to work and in Jamaica. And the charge sheet is filed today. Can I, can I please, can I please complete? I'm answering each one so of your questions. No, I, I know, just want to know what's the charge I know that you're having a problem accepting the facts, but can I please? You asked me to explain, I'll take you through it. You will have no ambiguities after that. This is not an attempt, ma'am, to canvas support can for the Prime Minister on the I eve of election day in Karnataka. So. Trust me, this is details that have been brought to my notice. I'm only putting it out in the public domain. Now, what does the charge sheet say? And I'm quoting it. They are quoting these individuals who are exchanging messages 
Messages were exchanged a year before the arrest, September 10, 2016 at 11.24 p.m. One of the accused, Mirza, had messaged the following. Pistol by Karna Ho surely. Then I will try to find a contact with him. Now, who was being referred to as him is not clear. This is also what the chart sheet says. Now, according to this chart sheet... So this chart were, sheet was filed today. I am just asking you, please? you. I just want to know when did ATS file the chart sheet? That's 40, all I want to know. 48 was hours, it filed today? 48 hours ago. Can I just, can I quickly come out here please and explain the... What difference does it make whether it was filed two days back or three days ago? The fact of is it's been it makes filed... A difference. It makes a lot of difference, Rahul. Okay. Are I'll you give doubting? you a whole sequence of when chart oh, sheets get filed so around So you're suggesting the day, you know? that the chart sheet I'm not was doubting filed you. I'm saying chart to sheets get filed. Sympathy. No, I, I know where you're going men. with this. Of course. I know so where you're going cases, with this. It's I very will, sad. I will send it's you very a sad. dossier of cases it is very that sad. fall apart. A Just chart tell sheet? me when the chart sheet was filed. Okay. No, I find it okay. very sad that chart sheets get filed okay. just before an election is happening. That is what I find very sad. April and 20th is not just before an election. April 20th is not just before an election. A few weeks ago is not just before an election. Please, the work of the nation cannot stop so because there's an election. You. When was it filed? I'm telling you, April 20th. It was filed in April 20th. Okay. What difference does it make? I can't understand. The news is more important. The gravity of the story should be of more greater concern. Okay, now, we accessed this chart sheet a few days ago. That's what matters. I'm sorry that it was delayed. And it wasn't DHL delivered to me. It took a little while. Nonetheless, what does it say? According to this chart sheet, at around 11.28, Mirza received a reply from a social media contact calling himself Ferrari. And this is what that message says. Yeah. Let's take Modi out with a sniper rifle. So I want to say more. So this serious conspiracy to kill a prime minister was lying buried in some chat sheet and only your guy could get it and nobody else got to know about so it. So are I you mean, suggesting that this, this was put very, into very my no, that was put into my coat pocket? I'm not saying anything. No, what are I'm you not saying? saying anything, I mean, what? Rahul. Why are you taking this debate? Out, I am trying. The I debate should be more about journalist. the rhetoric, no, irresponsible rhetoric that is creating and fanning hate against a very important constitutional authority of this country. And what maybe we should all introspect because tomorrow, Rahul, if something untoward worried. happens, God I am forbid. Very, very worried about rhetoric. I am very worried about rhetoric. Well, then I am very about rhetoric. Then I am very it. worried Make about the future of a country where the ruling party, where the ruling party endorses rhetoric of hate against minorities. That is the rhetoric I am worried about. Who doesn't sit here that and condemn it? You have been on several debates with me where I, I have condemned it, ma'am. people more than leaders. Saba Nakvi, you have been on yeah. debates with me so where we have condemned so this rhetoric. Like. What takes you yeah. so long to come out and condemn the yeah, rhetoric exactly. that has so been I used by politicians, rhetoric. leading lights on the opposition side? People like Mulayam Singh, candidates of the Congress, the former Congress president to vilify, create hate. Because the consequences are such, I'm sure you should apply equal yardsticks here. Nonetheless, I want to Sonia open this up. Gandhi, Let Sonia me bring Gandhi, it. Sonia Gandhi, I have Sonia Gandhi she lost. She has put an allegation on ruling party, so I want to come in. In the context of Gujarat okay. riot. Rahul, you want to come in? You can come Rahul, in, sir. Can I get a chance to Go speak? ahead. Go I ahead, want sir. to respond to Sabha yeah. that she had said that the ruling party is having a rhetoric against Rahul, Muslims. This is totally in contrast yeah. to the fact. If the then ruling party Congress Prime Minister says that the Muslim should have first right over the national resources of India and we oppose, then we are called anti-Muslim. When Simi, the student for Islamic movement in India, duly banned by Supreme Court of India and the ruling, then ruling party says this is a cultural organization, we oppose, then we are called anti-Muslim. When Mulayam Singh Yadav says, I have killed 16 
Hindus for the sake of Muslims. We oppose. Uh, then we become anti-Muslim. Then we oppose any terrorists. We become anti-Muslim. When 2611 was conducted by Pakistan, and Dikvijay Singh says it was a mastermind of RSS, that? we oppose. What we become anti-Muslim. So, ones? in my opinion. Sabaji should go and study the AK and Tony but committee report of, of 2014 defeat of Congress. Then she will be able to conclude that who is responsible for this so-called rhetoric against Muslims. It was a blatant communal politics. And not only I am saying pro-Muslim. Are by Muslims guys say what Duksan in order to say that we always have to say that where Yaakub Menon and Abdul Guru Ini are with you. Why are you not with Abdul Kalam? Why are you not Believe Muslims should live in Pakistan. आप सिद्धांशु आप भी जानते हैं कि जो दिल्ली में बैठे हुए मंत्री वो कहते हैं बहुत सारे लिस्ट मैं तैयार कर देती हूँ आपको भेज देती हूँ कि मुसलमान को पाकिस्तान जानते हैं काफी लोग कह चुके हैं आपके क्योंकि इट इज़ द पाकिस्तान इट इज़ द कांग्रेस पार्टी विच इज़ हैविंग अ वेरी सिम्टोमेटिक इकोसिस्टम Tipu Sultan Jayanti is, is uh, celebrated with great fan and fear in Karnataka government and so in Pakistan. Now tell me, now go and tell me Mani Shankar Ayyar in Pakistan. Salman Khursi in Pakistan. Tell me, Hafiz Saeed Sushir Shinde gives you a message on the Hindu Atangabad issue. So, why do we not do this? It is a Congress party which reverberates with what we saw in Pakistan. Okay, one minute. Let me come in here. Tell me, Sabah Ji. Tell me, Sabah Ji. Dikvijay Singh says 2611 is the RSS conspiracy. Whose side is taking? He is taking the side of Pakistan and Hafiz Saeed. Why do we have to demonize the Chinese community? Can you give me 30 seconds here? There are other panelists also. Varis Pathan, Varis Pathan, one minute, Ilya Shirashtudi in one second, Varis Pathan, Varis Pathan, Varis Pathan, has the opposition's attempt, and I'm asking you this question with all responsibility, so please respond today in a responsible manner, has the opposition's attempt to sympathize with Buran Wani, Yaqub Memon, only emboldened Islamist terrorist sir, to such an extent that today they want to take out the Prime Minister in their words with a sniper rifle. Islamic terrorism. terrorism of any kind is condemnable. Whosoever is involved in a terrorist activity, we are totally against that. But here, what we see, Rahul, no, 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 you are not. You see, there, you are not. Just few no, no, you are not. The, was the MIM has no, very great sympathies for Yakub Memon. my point. Yakub Memon, bhul gaye. No, we don't have any sympathies. Oh, see, really? We are with the law. Really, following sir, the law, what were you saying about Yakub Memon? Yes, I have got sympathy for No, I'll tell sides. you. I'll tell you what was said. Yakub Memon your boss, your party boss, Asaduddin Oweisi. No, 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 no. One the second. The Yakub Memon was hanged was totally wrong. Not me, even Ram Jaitavalani, the MP of the BJP government has gone that time. Tista Settlement has gone. But here, what I find is that the FIR... No, 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 I'm going to remind you what Asaduddin Oweisi said. Memon, Yakub Memon being hanged because he's Muslim. आपने ये बोला आपकी पार्टी ने ये बोला राहुल बिकॉज़ ऑफ ही वाज मुस्लिम सो ही वाज हैंग नॉट बिकॉज़ ही वाज अ टेररिस्ट बट बिकॉज़ ही वाज अ मुस्लिम टोटली कंट्रेरी टू व्हाट वी हैव सीन इन सो मेनी इयर्स no sir, I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry sir. Let me tell you Rahul. You no, are no, no, equating no, no. terrorism with religion constantly. So went to the president with a memorandum saying that the way in which Raku Mehman is Aap being hanged is totally contrary to what you How much hate will you fan? How much hate will you fan sir? Your hate will plunge India into chaos. They will be rioting. There will be murders, the hate is not there, there will be political executions, the, the and you will have to take responsibility. Me, okay, let, you cannot run away. You cannot oh, run okay, away. You allow me to make my point, Rahul. Here in the present situation, what you said in the chart sheet is filed just recently. The FIR was already there. If the FIR was there, the Ram Jait Malani the said Asaduddin Awaisi's remarks, remarks are wrong. The court is, is impartial. They have recorded no. the statement under Ram Jait Malani has said courts are impartial. What made you bring it Asaduddin out today? Asaduddin Awaisi's remarks are wrong. Sir, you can't take a position against terrorists. My question is You can't is support your prime minister. We are not against. We are totally against terrorists. Really? Totally then why were you saying Yaqub Memon was only hanged because but he was a Muslim? The situation is different. 
जुडिशरी 70 people including ram jethwalani the mp of the bjp he government didn't. he didn't he said courts are impartial you're misquoting him sir that the way in which you're misquoting him you're misquoting him sir you're misquoting him for your own now benefit the question to the bjp stop this stop this sir take a position tonight take a position tonight one minute ram jethwalani went to the president whether ram jethwalani was for the hanging or was against the hanging of yakub mehman ask this question to mr sudan jutrewali ask this question to the final judgment of the supreme, court of, the supreme court of india what was the final judgment of supreme court of india supreme in the case court, of abdul guru and yakub mehman supreme, supreme court has said in the case of abdul guru that is a matter of rare sudan rare time was to rare was the rare crime people who went to the president so they tend to defend him that he was killed because he was a muslim went to the president take with a memorandum and say that you are trying to give member is hanging is not color are you not aware of crime did mr ram jethwalani your mp did you are giving a communal color to corruption simple question you are trying to give a communal color to terrorism सर जू क्या हो गया आप लोगों को व्हाट इज हैपन टू ऑल यू पॉलिटिशियंस टुडे हु इज ऑफ द हियर इज अ ब्लॉक टू असेसिनेट द प्राइम मिनिस्टर एंड इंस्टेड ऑफ रिनाउंसिंग और बहुत टेक्स्ट ऑफ यू रिनाउंसिंग टेरर रिनाउंसिंग द रेसिस्ट ऑफ हेट डिनाउंसिंग द टेररिस्ट यू आर टुडे क्वेश्चनिंग द प्राइम मिनिस्टर आई कांट बिलीव व्हाट इज गोइंग ऑन इन दिस कंट्री और अफजल गुरु एंड याकूब मेरे कंफेसर्स फॉर ऑल दोस इयर्स दे वर स्पेंड इन द जेल शॉकिंग वन मिनट One minute. Let me approach Mr. Majid Haidri. No, no, Rahul. No, no, no. I'm sorry, sir. To today, today, we hoped upon you to condemn, to condemn, condemn outright. Condemn outright. Condemn outright. You should be cautioning Why the Congress, today? the other opposition Can't parties, from villainizing the Prime Minister in the eyes of a community. Because of the more they do it, the more you send that committee, uh, the community the into the hands of radicals. Do you know what damage you are doing to this country and its social and democratic fabric? In Cong in Congress rule, Sita Marai government's rule, several Muslim youths are languishing in Karnataka. You have burned Kashmir already, sir, to the ground. This is what we have said. Now don't do this to the rest of this country. Don't do it, sir. Don't do it, please. Both have I beg you. Try to see that the Muslims don't come up. One minute. Yes. One minute. I want to bring in Majid Haidri. He's been very patient. He's raising his hand. Majid Haidri I want to come out to you sir I'm asking you this question in all honesty has the attempt of individuals in the opposition those that are critical of the BJP to sympathize with the Burhan Wani's Yakub Memons only emboldened Islamist terrorists simple question to you Majid sir Rahul I am I hope I am given a minute for my patience See, there are three points. If ever Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji had a threat to his life, it was when a foreign pilot flew him in a single-engine plane from Sabarmati River. The second time he had a threat to his life was when he made a stopover in Pakistan to say "Happy Birthday" to Nawaz Sharif ji. Point number two: If these pet names like Mohd ka Sodagar make any sense, then Rahul Gandhi has a bigger threat because he is always called Papu, and then he is called a dynastic icon. so there is a threat and more of a threat because he comes from a family which is so forgiving that they forgave the assassinators of rajiv gandhi ji now the third point if it is about victimizing muslims ahead of elections you don't need to say there is a threat to prime minister's life you can simply say there is threat to life of a cow and that is how the muslims will get targeted why to make a big story a big novel that prime minister there is threat to prime minister's life come up with a simple point that a cow has a threat to her life this is all i have to say Mr Majid Haidri look at you look at you sir today look at you sir today it's not even funny it's not even funny it is shocking it is beyond belief today 
that there are citizens of our country no, it was funny who are when justifying, Prime was flown who are away justifying by a, pilot a potential assassination attempt protocol. on the Prime Minister it of this country. On the part of Look at where we have come Rahul as a nation and as a people. And Dr. Dr. Rakesh Sinha wants to come in. Yes, in a Dr. Rakesh Sinha, do you have a response? Do you have a response? Would you like to furnish a response, Dr. Rakesh Sinha? Rahul. Rahul, Rahul, I am surprised that my fellow panelists are trying to trivialize the threat on Prime Minister. This is not a normal debate. This is not a rhetoric. No, 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 you no, know, no, in politics, there, there, there are rhetoric political parties. Sir, political parties accuse each, each other. Why but when you are trying to project, you are trying to project the prime minister and a particular ideology is Gujarat, against a particular religion. Then you are giving a message to radical from that religion and that section the, of the people the Gujarat to, uh, to, to, to have conspiracy against the prime minister, to have conspiracy against the particular ideology. That the same thing right from Sonia Gandhi, Sonia Gandhi to the hate brigade is doing. And I am, I am. This is this is really shocking. Majid Menon is saying that this is non-issue. This is this is non-issue. You are calling the if Rahul, someone is calling Rahul Gandhi Papu and someone Sir, is calling Narendra Modi, Mohan Sodagar, both are the same thing. Gujarat? You are why trying to create an image of Prime Minister Gujarat that is an anti-Muslim, that is so a threat to the Muslim community. That's why the radicals of the Muslim community is targeting him. Both are the most important point. Ma, Why kindly, are such kindly listen to me. Don't shout, don't shout the here. Don't to know. shout here. Second important thing that I have a question to Sava. No, Sava such Nakhmi. stories always Sava, scripted you know, out of Gujarat? When, when, question when to Sava Sonia Nakhmi. Gandhi, Sonia Gandhi legitimized and given respect to Batla House encounter. The terrorists who were killed in Batla House and Sonia Gandhi, Sonia Gandhi wait for them. When you are giving legitimacy to the terrorist, radical terrorist belonging to Islamic terrorism, then you are trying to give, the, in, encouraging them, encouraging them th and using them to your political adversary. So, Saman Akhvi, that's the question that for you. They should, they should the question is straightforward. Adversary. After and this chilling expose, can opposition parties up? continue to really float with organizations so having a radical Islamist agenda? Simple question. You see what's going on in Karnataka. Congress, no, my objective is Rahul Congress calling it a radical Islamic agenda. With the this PFI, is SDPI. Rahul, stop. This is what it gets us. Of the this is what it Rahul, gets us. Please stop demonizing this is what it gets us. of the Muslim youths, please. First. And MIM, MIM is giving legal aid to the uh, ISIS Rahul, accused. I, I, I really OBC, like this. OBC is uh, giving legal aid to ISIS accused. I like this so debate. How can you fight against it? We if have you, to take a fracture. If you have not objected for the case enough, so if anybody comes to me, Hindu, Muslim, Sikh, Isai, if you provide legal aid, what happens? I belong to the, 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 the school of journalism. Mr. Rakesh Sinha, let me answer you. I belong to. I am a journalist. I am not a believer of anything. As a journalist, I will treat every fact with skepticism. You are questioning Time Now investigation. investigation. You, you are a journalist. Oh and I you are questioning the investigation of Time Now. I believe in your in your own journalistic career, you have investigated so many things. Oh my you are God. questioning the integrity of Time Now. The, the Time Now is revealing at the time of the last election. Do not. This is this is irony. This is irony of your journalism. There is nothing which I will not question. I hope to continue to question the Prime Minister. I will continue to No, you to question, question. but Rahul you are questioning the very integrity of the investigative journalism. You, you are I congratulate there. Times Now that Times Now has revealed something, viewpoint. some chance it is hard by the you, you don't Shana, believe. You are, you are creating, a, you are creating a debate you have, in which people you should disbelieve Times Now. You people are should disbelieve it. You a particular ideology that I think is toxic. I, I, I know that you also toxic. belong to the hate debate. That is my view. You are also I part of the UPA. You are, you are not undeclared UPA lecture. intellectual. Do not I give me call you lecture. undeclared UPA I intellectual. I do not In no give way you, you, are, you are not objective to any debate. You, you are anti RSS, anti BJP, anti Hindutva intellectual. Yes, I call you anti Hindutva intellectual. I call you anti RSS intellectual. There is a binary in this country pro RSS and anti RSS. You belong to anti RSS. RSS camp. You should accept this in honestly. Okay. Have you ever praised RSS? Good, good. Have you ever gone to good, the RSS Sakha? Have you ever gone to the RSS so project? What will happen you, you will abuse RSS. Are you threatening me? All the time, no. all the life. Are you threatening me? Are you threatening me? Is that, is, is that, that, that a risk factor now? Should I be afraid? Okay. Should I be afraid of your... Why should any sane person, okay. journalist or non-journalist, okay. okay. you should not be afraid. Let me just step in here. Be honest. 
Too much. Be honest. If I call too myself much. a RSS, you should call you yourself as anti-RSS. No, too much rhetoric flying around. I think all of us now need to take a step back. We need to understand a couple of things. That there is an implication to every word we utter. Let's all pledge today, including the Netas, who are perhaps watching this broadcast, to be very mindful of what they're saying, when they're saying it, and to who they're saying it. Words directed at a personage with the attempt to vilify, with the attempt to fan hate, can have disastrous consequences. And political parties, change agents, opinion makers who do so to make gains are playing a deadly game. Deadly game. This will only plunge India into chaos. Viewers, this story two days before the Karnataka elections is not meant to rouse sympathy for the Prime Minister. But let us it, is only meant, it is only no, meant, it is only meant, don't heckle life. me. It is only meant, it is only meant to remind us all that we should not be swayed by the things that are said. Horrible, nasty things that are said for political gain by our netas during election season. We leave it at that. Coming up on the news are Rahul's Imandari kite snapped. Watch the stunning expose unfold. Big story. It's going to change the discourse in Karnataka.